sir. How are you today? All right. I'm, I'm a, Thompson, McPherson. a little hot. I'm with the police department here in sure. Bristol. The reason I'm talking to you is we've gotten some complaints about you going around filming in police department parking lots, things like that. What's going on? Welcome back, folks. Today we feature a video from a channel called Big G Audits, and he records out of the state of Tennessee. Every day we see a new auditing channel, but not every day do we see a channel like this. This guy's videos are making their rounds throughout the community. He's been featured on channels like Lackluster. He's like a master at verbal judo. He has the gift of gab, folks. He is an arbiter of rights, a teller of truth, and he's a First Amendment knowledge spreader. Are you guys catching my drift? Absolutely do not miss the opportunity to subscribe to what might possibly be one of your favorite channels, Big G Audits. I'm proud to feature this masterpiece on my channel. Everyone, enjoy this educational First Amendment audit video. Here we go, folks. Just doing some filming today. Just doing some filming today? Yes, sir. Okay. Are you looking into the, some of the Commonwealth Attorney's cars and things like that? I'm just... Places where they have a reasonable expectation of privacy? Uh, you know there's no reasonable expectation of privacy in public, sir. There, there is, sir. Inside of vehicles, there is. No, if you can see it from public, sir, you know better than that. No, that's not entirely accurate. Is that that's right? Accurate. You all don't use... Uh, you don't. You all use that to your benefit? No, sir. It's not? Absolutely not. Do you have your ID on you? Uh, no, sir. I don't have an ID on you me. You don't have an ID on you? No, sir. Okay. What's your name? Uh, I'm not giving my name, sir. I have okay. no reason to. Okay. Right. It's called the Plain View Doctor, and you should know about that. Anything you can see from public view is filmable and recordable. Okay. So, trespassing, I, I can, trespassing on property like over here where you're not allowed to be, restricted areas? Where, that, where's restricted that, areas? Right, right over here. Show, where me where it's, show me where it's restricted. Right over here where you were just Okay, at. let's we're go. Not, we're not walking over there. Show me where it's restricted. Where does it say restricted? Where's the restricted signs? Where's the private property signs? When you're over here on Where's the no property? Where? When you're over here on fire department property. Fire department. That's, that's, not, public. Public. that's not public property. Yes, sir, it is. No, sir, it's not. It's not funded by the public. It is funded by well, the public. But then it's public property. But they have a reasonable expectation of privacy with the fire department, too. Everything that's coming out of this cop's mouth is false, folks. Why do you think that is? Who do we put the blame on? The cop himself or his superiors? Maybe the training facilities? They don't seem to be training these cops in the First Amendment. You know what kind of training these cops get? It's the same thing that happens when they're briefed every day before they go out on the streets. They're trained to ask you for ID in the form of a threat under the guise of a question. They're trained to go and run everybody through the ringer. Let's see who we can take off the streets. Maybe we can catch a felon. Who cares if they violate your rights? They certainly don't. They're not being taught the First Amendment of the Constitution. They absolutely know nothing about it, but they swear an oath to it in order to get that job. We need to start training these officers in the First Amendment, folks. I've been advocating for that. Keep watching. Uh, sir, you, you don't know what... You know what Plain View Doctrine is, are, do are you? Are you the attorney? How do you know I'm not an attorney? Are you the attorney? How do you know that, I'm not an I'm attorney? Asking. How do you know are, are I'm you not an attorney? attorney? I don't know. That's why I'm Well, asking. all right. I'm well, don't doubt my intelligence. I'm trying to have a conversation. Well, I am trying to have one with you, too. Okay. All right. So you, what, what, you know what the, the Plain View Doctrine around, is, right? You know what the Plain View Doctrine is, right? Things like that. You know what the Plain View Doctrine is, right? I do know what the Plain View Doctrine is. Well, then why are you even questioning me? I absolutely do. Anything that you can see from public is recordable. Okay. So you're, you're, saying that that, simple. you're saying that people don't have a reasonable expectation of privacy inside their vehicle? No, sir. They have to. The onus is on them to create that privacy, just like in your squad car. I can walk up to your squad car right now and film everything I can see in here because it's called Plain View Doctrine. You've left your computer on, which is not a good thing. Is it not? Because that's on you to okay. create that privacy on that computer, right? Okay. Right? No. That's not right. No. Is it on me to create that privacy? Am uh, I the one that's supposed you, to shut it? Are, are you schooled with the police department policy or anything like I am, that? sir, and in normal constitutional law as well. Okay. Yes, sir. Are right, you? So, so basically, you're just out here to cause trouble for everybody. I didn't talk to anybody. So yes, who's causing the trouble? You're, you're the one that stopped me. Listen, you're you're just, the one that I'm stopped not, me. I'm not stopping you. Guys. Yes, I'm you did. You hollered for me and told me to stop. Did you not? Listen, I, I did you to, not? I All right. So then you stopped me. So don't no, say you didn't. I'll oh, shut the fuck up. You mind if I talk for just a second? 
second. I'll talk to you, but okay. he, he ain't make no fucking sense. So we just we got a call down here. He's been As a you dick. can probably understand, you're open carrying a firearm, mm -hmm. which is fine, okay? And you yes, also sir. have a mask on. That yes, can sir. cause some public concern. With the COVID today, seriously. I'm just saying somebody openly Seriously. Just, just understand, now who's being just, just ridiculous? Understand where I'm coming from, okay? Someone, no, I don't know where I'm you're coming you from. I'm just what the call was that we received. Well, I don't okay? give a shit what the call uh, was. So that's why if we I'm breaking here, the listen, law, we come down don't here to make raise sure your voice, to me, we sir. You're the servant. To make understand sure that that you are safe. Don't and everyone else is safe. safe okay. I'm, I'm the happy to talk over Fuck top you. of you. Fuck you. Have a nice day, bitch. Fuck you. I ain't wasting my breath with your dumb ass. I'm done. Have a good day, sir. Keep stepping, bitch. You're dismissed. Have a good day. Fuck you. Tell everybody in there they need to close the curtains. I've got social security numbers all in the open. That's called plain view doctrine. Dumb shits. Right now, your if it was, it, it, this on them. They're the one to get in trouble. You dumb shit. It's not resp my responsibility to hide people's information, is it? Is it? Is it? Yeah. On them, because they're the ones that would lose it, you dumb shit. You want to go that? Are you that stupid? No, I'm not, because I'm standing there. If it was identity theft, you'd be hooking me the fuck up, wouldn't you? Well, right now you're being disorderly. Hook me the fuck up. Right now you're being disorderly. This is not disorderly. You can't be the complaining in the disorderly, you stupid shit. God almighty, y'all are fucking retarded. I, you can be the complaining in the disturbance call. You are retarded. Then hook me up then. Dumb ass fuckers. How fucking stupid. Bristol sign is right there, and I thought I wasn't going to get nothing today. Sorry for the pacing back and forth and turning around all the time. He had me fired the fuck up, guys. I was tore up. What a bunch of retards. <sighs> I pledge allegiance to this flag of the United States of America and to the republic which stands, one nation, under God, indivisible. Training on the front end gives the officers the basis for their everyday operation on the road. The, uh, the practice that they have at the academy is the knowledge that comes to them in split-second decisions that they have to make. They don't have time to refer to textbooks, they don't have time to refer to law books. Repetitive training, scenario-based training is what kicks in when they don't have time to, to think on the street. And that's what's so critical uh, for their safety and their survival. It's tough. Um, it's enjoyable and it's well worth it at the end of the 12 weeks. I don't like to see what's going on in society where we have so many problems with the police when they're such good people and you know we're normal people and we want to be treated that way and we want to treat those we come in contact with with respect and I think we need to bridge that barrier where we see mo so much of the problems that are going on in society. The interest in law, just being out around the community, just being around people, just that's what I like to do. The instructors, they very knowledgeable about laws and procedure for police officers, and they do a good job training us here. This is the best time for anybody to go into it because it's so dangerous and, the, and society needs us the most right now. I want to make sure I go home. I want to make sure all of them go home. Be open-minded and be nice. I've been interested for a long time, started getting involved in my community and realized that this is really what I want to do. So um, I know I can make a difference in my community. I, I've, I know I'm, I'll do good at this job, so I can help people. Be prepared um, physically before you come here. Um, be, be prepared uh, uh, in your private life to, to uh, have a really clean record and uh, be dedicated, be dedicated from the, the, from the word go.
Now, if you're still here and you watched the full video and you paid close attention to that propaganda training video, you guys realize that they're not training these officers in the First Amendment. That's a huge problem, folks. The people are waking up, picking up cameras, and recording their public officials, documenting every encounter. Because of that, we're able to see exactly what's happening. We're able to pinpoint with precision accuracy the root of the problem in policing in America. We are not training police in the First Amendment or the Constitution. Clearly, they are only being trained to be violent. And that, my friends, is an unsustainable system. You guys subscribe to my channel and also subscribe to the original channel. I'll drop the link in the description and in the pinned comment. Thank you all for tuning in. We'll see you on the next video. Peace.